The next episode in our pull away dive trip is a combination of two or three different dive sites. And you can see this particular reef is covered in mushroom coral. And like most of the reefs around Pulaway, the water column above the reef is covered in red tooth triggerfish and tiny little red basslets. Down on the sand, it's quite common to find different kinds of gobies. These are actually called fire dart fish. They're always found in pairs and they live in a small hole in the sand or in the substrate. Uh, it's quite unusual to see them out of their hole like this, so I took a few minutes to film them. As I was filming them out of the corner of my eye, I caught this guy. He is a juvenile sweet lip, and it's actually a juvenile oriental sweet lip. And sweet lips, like uh, angelfish, have very different colorations when they're juvenile. And this is what he turns into when he becomes an adult. So the only sign left of his juvenile coloration, if you look closely here, you can see the orange around his eyes and just on the side of his pectoral fins. Many different kinds of scorpion fish along the substrate. This is quite an unusual one. He's called a devil scorpion fish. They're not very good swimmers. They tend to move around on the bottom of the reef. And this is a very classic reef scene anywhere in Pulaway. 30, 40 different species in any given shot. These are fusiliers and they're actually at a cleaning station. If you look closely, you can see the blue streaked cleaner ass. Uh, he's going in and cleaning all the mouths of the fusiliers. This is a kind of cleaner shrimp. It's called a banded boxer shrimp. Uh, they're often found in pairs, uh, but on this occasion he seems to be by himself and he's actually just hovering next to an adhesive anemone. And the unfortunate thing is when you come in close with the camera to film him, it scares away the fish that would otherwise come in for a cleaning. So I wasn't able to film him actually doing his job. This is a peacock mantis shrimp. And for some reason, he's taken in a dead red tooth triggerfish into his hole. Now I'm not sure if he killed the triggerfish or it's perhaps been attacked by another fish but uh, I managed to film him as he was removing the fish from his hole so that was something quite interesting. Manta shrimp have the most advanced eyes of any animal in the world and whereas humans actually have four photoreceptors to allow us to perceive light and color Manta shrimp actually have 16. It's a fantastic dive destination. It's called Pulaway. Yeah, you can get there by flying from Kuala Lumpur into a place called Banda Aceh. And from there, it's a short boat ride to Pulaway.